I take 50,000 to pass. Take my brush so the bronze doesn't spray everywhere. It'll look like this if I don't use the brush. So I set the brush in there. And it falls down here. I watch my dial. When it hits one inch, I stop it, back it up. Shut it off, get our micrometers. Do a quick read. It says it's 706. It's cutting six thousandths too big. So I will back this dial off. Six. Now when I turn it to 100, I've actually turned it 105. Next number will fall on a correct number. We're shooting for 550 thousandths. Six hundred and fifty perfectly. Now we know this is going to be right, but we check it anyway. Measure twice, cut once. So it is 602. I can live with 2000 is too big. So this next pass will be our final pass because we said 602. Now we're going to 550. It says 150 here. We crank her over to 200. this out, put a nice little shoulder on it. That's it for that. Next we're going to poke a 375 thousandths hole in the end. So we'll come over here, we get Mr. Tailstock. Yeah. Bring it up here so you can see what I'm doing. That's a center drill. It doesn't flex when you're drilling. So you get a more accurate hole. Bring it up close, lock it. The lathe is a little quieter now because I disengaged my drive gears down here. And that's a center drill. This is our 375 thousandths drill bit, otherwise known as a 3 8 Well, I'll bring this up to one inch on, there's graduations on here. I'll bring it up to one inch. I'm going to drill a little over an inch into it. Bring it up to where it touches. Back it off so it doesn't squeal. Now we crank her in one inch. Uh, one inch and hundred thousandths. Because we're going to part this off and leave a shoulder on it. This is the quiet part of machining bronze. Little gold flakes just Roll on out of the flutes of the drill. 
we're kind of coming up on our one inch mark right there. That's sixteenth. And that's an eighth. Back it off. That's it for that. Just to make it look nice, we will turn this surface. that just to make it look nice get rid of this oh and this is the tool we were using I don't remember what it's called anymore but yours there's your carbide insert and that's our tool holder this is a parting tool Because this operation, we are parting the part off of our stock. This only has to be eyeballed. I just need some material in there so that when I press this bushing into the hinge, it doesn't fall all the way through. So that's that. Hang on. This is a deburring tool. Deburs it. Nice, huh? File. Just a little touch. Always hold it like this, never like this. You drive that right through the palm of your hand. A little touch, touch. Now there's no more burr right there. Get in here, be a little more careful. Touch, touch. Broken edge. Now, now we parked. Look at that, a bushing. Oops, how's that instead? Ooh, a bushing, perfect bushing.